G'day everyone. If you are looking to add or remove company page admins on LinkedIn, you have come to the right place. I'm Michelle J. Raymond, company pages expert and B2B growth strategist. And I want to teach you just how easy it is to add and remove company page admins and why it's really important that you stay on top of this. So the first tip that I want to give you before we dive into the how-to is make sure that you're always, 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 always have a company page admin backup. So more than just one person as a company page admin on your company page. Why do I say this? Pretty simple because lots and lots of people right now are ending up in LinkedIn jail, i.e. you can't get into your account. So sometimes this is happening to people who aren't doing anything wrong as far as they know. They're not doing anything untoward, not trying to use automated tools, but for some reason their accounts are still getting flagged. So if this happens, you want to make sure that there's always somebody else in your business that can access the page. The last thing you want to do is get locked out. Trust me, LinkedIn help right now. You're talking about delays of weeks. So that's why this is really important. To add, edit, or remove a company page admin, we need to be in the page admin admin view, which we're in now. And LinkedIn recently rearranged the layout. So we need to go down onto the left-hand side now into settings. And then up the top, we've got manage admins. And as it says there, control who manages your page. Really important thing to do. And you can see everything we need to do is in here. We have two options for page admins that look after the organic side. And the second tab is for paid media admins. So that is if you outsource to an agency to look after all of your paid LinkedIn strategies, you can grant them access, which will give them access to different parts of LinkedIn without seeing the normal admin view that you've got over here. So on the page admins tab, you can see any existing page admins. In this case, we've got two, as I said earlier, always have a backup. To add an admin, just click on add admin, no surprises. And I'm going to start typing Michelle B. Griffin. And there she is. And then I can give her different levels of access. So I'm going to make her a content admin just so that you can see it. We click on save and ta-da, now we've got three. Now, if I want to remove that access, then I click on the garbage bin that's beside her name. If I want to change the level of access that she has, I would click on the pencil and I'm back to this. I have the three different levels, super admin, content admin, or analyst. So we've got those changes. So in this particular case, I'm going to go and remove that access again. It's now going to come up and say, are you sure anything that she's scheduled will now be transferred across to me? So I'm sure. So that's handy to know. If you haven't used the LinkedIn schedule post feature yet, that's what they're talking about. So you can see right there, everything you do for page admins is all from this screen. Add with this button, edit with the pencil or delete with the garbage bin. Super simple. After this video is finished, I want you to take a moment to go into your page admin view, click on settings, manage page admins and see who's got what access in your business. You might actually be surprised who's still lurking around. Maybe it's somebody that left years ago. Maybe you realize you've only got one page admin. So it's worth taking a couple of minutes to check this. And I've just shown you how you can do it really easily. There's not really too much more to this. You go into the same place to add and remove. Make sure that you've always got a backup page admin. And importantly, if someone leaves, make sure that you've got a process in place that you also remove that admin access on the company page. So if you have enjoyed this and looking for more company page tips and how to use LinkedIn to grow your business, then please don't forget to subscribe to the channel, leave me a comment, but most of all, come and find me on LinkedIn. I'm Michelle J. Raymond, and it's been a pleasure to share this with you. Cheers.